This coming Sunday will mark 10 years since anyone has seen or heard anything from a woman named Maura Murray. Now, the college student crashed her car on Route 112 in North Haver, 140 miles north of the UMass Amherst campus that she had left just a few hours earlier. Mara had vanished when police arrived. There was what appeared to be indications that she may have been running away, but her father and investigators think there is much more to her disappearance. My initial thought is still my what I think, and that's that somebody locally grabbed her. Twelve years ago today, Maura vanished from this very spot on a cold, dark night. She has not been seen or heard from since. Is it safe to call us armchair detectives with a camera and a microphone? It's something that starts as a hobby and gradually grows into something more obsessive. And he said, do you think that's blood? And people said, uh, yeah, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know that it's dangerous to do something like what we're doing right now, but there are some questionable characters involved who may be listening at some point. Hopefully. <laughs> What's going on right now? Well, we're in uh, Lincoln, New Hampshire. We're at the Roadway Inn. Someone knew we were going to be in Lincoln. It can break me down and get me. Coordinates right here. Why would she go willingly into a car? If I came across this house and I was running it alone in the dark. There is no way that someone that knows that their daughter is missing, knows why they're missing, or had anything to do with it, would spend 12 years looking for their daughter, would put this whole thing on for 12 years, taking over their lives. I know, it took over mine. She was familiar? She does? Where, where would I be able to find her? In the morgue. What just happened? On a mission to find his missing daughter, Mora, Fred Murray went to Concord to see Governor Lynch. Frustrated with the state police investigation into her disappearance, Mr. Murray is asking the governor to release all her case files, and he'd like the FBI to get involved in the investigation. Roman statesman uh, philosopher named Juvenal around the year 100 AD, he asked a question for the ages. Who is the God, the gods themselves? Down the rest one last time goodbye, dear friend. She was our buddy, and we want her back. There's no way in the hot place that I can stop looking for my daughter, so I am never going to stop.